Strawberries glistening in the sun await thousands of children who will visit Miss Heather's strawberry farm in Albany. In addition to strawberries, the UPIC farm has picnic and play areas. It's a popular destination for field trips, and it was the setting for an LSU Ag Center workshop on agritourism safety. We have certified agritourism operators as well as folks trying to get into agritourism. So they're here to learn what they need to do to make their, the farm that they will eventually develop safe. Hazards were intentionally set up around Heather Hughes's farm. Workshop participants walked the farm to see if they could spot the dangers. Hughes said she volunteered her farm for the workshop because she thought it could help improve safety at her operation. It's good for me too to learn things. If somebody else comes in there, they may see something that we don't see um, and we can fix something. Marsha Salsuito, an agricultural youth safety specialist, said 33 children are hurt on a farm each day and every three days one is killed. She presented an extensive outlook on safety and hazards on the farm and provided checklists and resources that agritourism operators can use to ensure their farm is safe. We get so used to what we see on our farms on a daily basis that we sometimes become blind to things that are there and to the hazards that are there. Salsuito said common issues include unsafe pathways, lack of barriers to restricted areas, playgrounds without proper ground cover, and inadequate hand washing stations. This is the second workshop series funded through a grant from the U.S. Department of Agriculture's National Institute of Food and Agriculture and the Southern Risk Management Education Center. The three main components that we identified for Louisiana was uh, legal risks, financial risks, and then we wanted them, to, the people, the participants, to have the opportunity to visit an actual agritourist operation. And the best topic to tie in with that was safety and emergency management and preparedness. A similar workshop was held at the Ag Center's Hill Farm Research Station in Homer. With the LSU Ag Center, this is Toby Blanchard reporting.